Here are three blessings of sexual purity. When you operate in sexual purity, it does not affect your discernment. You know, there's an old saying that says that love is blinding, but I beg to differ. You see, God is love, and so God will always unveil things to you. It is lust that is blinding. Um, And so be sure to walk in sexual purity because then you'll be able to see the red flags that God is trying to show you. Some of you might justify when you're walking in impurities. You might justify and, oh, it's all good but no it's not all good god is telling you to run but you're blinded because you're having sex and it's binding you together Mm. number two is when you operate in sexual purity it leaves no room for shame how many of you guys know that the enemy is always quick to tell you how something tastes but he never tells you the repercussions of it and oftentimes the big repercussions of it that's hard to get rid of is shame and you know friends there's nothing like living a life of peace and when you do things right then you'll live in a peaceful state of mind so good and when you operate in sexual purity you honor god i mean how many of you want to honor god god created our bodies he created sex it's a good thing there's no shame on sex but he created it to be within a marriage mm. and so when we honor god with that act we when we uh practice sexual purity we are honoring god with that act and if you want to dive deeper into sexual purity check out our book a call to purity it is available on amazon and loveawaysministries.com